In tonight's On the Rise, our look at promising young athletes in our viewing area. Boxing certainly has its critics. While some say it is violent, others call it a means of escape. The town of Wilson has seen its share of violence, but one young athlete is fighting his way out. Todd Gibson has his story. Houses boarded up and abandoned. It's a common sight in the town of Wilson. And in these neighborhoods, drugs and crime thrive. But one man made it out. Skip Crumpler used boxing to fight his way out. Now he's hoping to help others do the same. Because I know they're going to be fighting out there in the street. Why not make it legit? Come to the gym, you know, and get recognized. That's exactly what 13-year-old Corey Ham is doing. What they're doing... Other things, bad things, playing games, I'm working hard on gym. Five days a week, Ham makes his way to the Reed Street Gym. He's been doing this since he was five years old. While other young fighters come and go, Ham has stuck to the sport. Hey, I'm impressed with his kids, so I started putting in more time with Corey, but I was surprised that he'd been with the program this long. Ham also excels at basketball and football. Those two sports tug at his heart, enough to take him away from his first love. Sometimes I want to, but I have to stay in the ring and fight. Ham's biggest fan is his dad. Chiron Sapp keeps his son pointed in the right direction. Still, watching your son in a physical sport like boxing is not easy. Raising someone and then you have to take him into combat, that is difficult. But it's better than the alternative, a route too many young kids in Wilson have taken. A lot of the kids in the hood mostly forgotten. They come from broken homes and everything. I can reach out to them. I feel like I can reach out to them better than anyone because I lived in that kind of environment. Now, Crumpler fuels the dreams of young boxers like Corey Ham. Go to the Olympics and be a champion one day. This kid got boxing in his blood, and you don't find many kids like that. One out of a million. And one less kid on the mean streets of Wilson. Ty Gibson, WNCN Sports. So from football to volleyball, hockey, and boxing, there are young phenoms across our area. For a list of the promising athletes, go to WNCN.com and click on sports.